Uh, evening guys, welcome to Football Brownie. I uh, hope you're all well, looking after yourself, looking after each other, and spreading the love. Because we all we all need some love in, especially us Cardiff City fans at the moment. Anyway, Cardiff were today dumped out of the FA Cup as they lost by a goal to nil away to Nottingham Forest. Now, normally I would be raging about the defending once again. But, in all, in all fairness, Neil Harris's team... No, sorry. Neil Harris's inept, constant game management, team selection and tactics have drained the hell out of me. Not just today, but throughout the season. However, good news could be on the horizon. Breaking news from uh, internet press source Global 24-7 is reporting this evening a Cardiff City had sack manager Harris. Now, before I go any further, this story, the link will be in the des uh, description below. And don't shoot the messenger, okay? If this turns out to be misinformation. So, uh, I'm just going by what the story is saying. Championship club Cardiff City are set to sack their account manager, Neil Harris, in the morning, in brackets, Sunday. Harris, who lost another match this afternoon, this time in the FA Cup to, uh, to Nottingham Forest, uh, rain seems to be over after Cardiff City directors held emergency talks whilst the team and its current manager travelled back from the city ground this afternoon. Talks are set to go into the early hours as the directors await to place their unanimous recommendation decision Jesus, try saying that with a lisp to club owner Vincent Tan, who's based in Malaysia. So, it goes into the early hours basically because of a time difference. According to sources, the Welsh club have actively been seeking a replacement in the last week or so after a bad run of form from leadership of former Millwall man Neil Harris. Tony Poulis, who, by the way, was my second choice after, after Slavon Bilic, but we'll go on to that after. after. Tony Poulis is the favourite on a list according to, uh, according to sources to take up a position after the sacking of Harris. Harris, who took over from legendary Neil Warnock, despite leaving, leading Cardiff City to the playoffs last season, has failed to muster the goods this term. While their current chairman publicly stated that he wanted a top six position well, he did state he wanted top six position in January, but uh, the article says after Christmas. Um, fans of a club, the majority of fans in a club don't appear to be in disagreement with the board, with hundreds of die-hard supporters calling for his head, calling for his head during the last several weeks. Oh, I would say thousands, actually, but uh, it is what it is. So, that's the breaking news this evening. Fingers crossed this is true. Fingers crossed that Santana agrees to what the board uh, have apparently been uh, uh, in agreement of. And fingers crossed we can actually get some proper performances on the, on the, um, on the pitch. Tony Poulis, a few people are going to be uh, um, in disagreement of, but... The reason Tony Poulis was my second choice after Bilic, basically because if they had Bilic, the playing style to what the team is used to, remember this is a Neil Warnock team, let's be honest. Okay, so the playing style which the, uh, the majority of the team would be used to would be quite direct, Warnock style direct. So if Bilic come in, whose playing style is completely different, then the board would have to Basically, give him a shed load of cash, which they never want to do, uh, because he would need to. You would need to have time to uh, build his own team. Where Poulis is, is different, because it's saving money as well. You see, 
Pulis is also a very similar style. Pul- uh, Pulis's management and uh, style is very similar to Warnock. Direct. So I can, I can see that the board are trying to think, right, okay, if we get some similar styles, then we don't have to pay, pay out for, uh, for different players. I think that's the idea behind it. So let's hope that uh, if that was the case, or if it is the case, then it will work. But um, I'll, say, I'll say, I'll put the link uh, below in, in the description. Please comment, please share, please like, uh, and fingers crossed, Neil Harris will finally be gone in the next few hours. Take care all, and enjoy the rest of your evening. Bye-bye.